Former NBA star Dennis Rodman, back from North Korea. Come talk to us. Showing off snapshots with his friend, North Korean dictator Kim Jong-un. Rodman fueled speculation that he would push Kim about imprisoned American Kenneth Bay. Now, a very different tune. Did you ask about Kenneth Bay, CNN? No, no, guess what? That's not my job to ask about Kenneth Bay. Okay. Guess what? Rodman showing off that famous temper. They asked Obama about that. They asked Obama. They, ask Obama. they said you're going to talk about guess it. Guess what? Ask Hillary Clinton. Why do you ask those, up? Ask those Bay is serving 15 years of hard labor and desperately ill, his family says. Rodman is the only person, only American, to have had contact with the North Korean leader. You cannot help but hope that their friendship would benefit Kenneth. So we were disappointed. The worm billed his trip as basketball diplomacy, but some aren't buying it. Rodman's behavior now on both of these trips are just absolutely outrageous. Uh, it just aids and abets one of the most dangerous regimes in real time. Kim's regime is running vast labor camps and developing nukes. But Rodman calls the young leader a, quote, awesome kid. I have no idea from his point of view what game he's playing, although you can just take a look at the obvious. He's getting phenomenal coverage. Someone who hasn't put the ball into the basket in years is now uh, being talked about in, uh, you know, in capitals around the world.